Welcome guys to my channel. In today's video, I want to solve another nice maths uh, exponential challenge which reads a to the power of a is equals to 2 to the power of uh, root of 200. So we are looking for the possible value for a. So please if you are new here, kindly subscribe and by the time you subscribe, please don't forget to turn on the notification button so that you get notified anytime I drop videos of mathematics. So let's see how we can solve this. We can solve this by saying solution solution okay having done this we write our question which is a to the power of a is equals to 2 the root of 200 root of 200 so just written this recall the root of 200 root of 200 is also equals to uh, the root of 25 times times 8 okay and according to the uh, uh, product of radicals, product of radicals, we are having root of p times q is also equals to the root of p times the root of q. This is q. We are having q here. So if you put this principle here, we can have this root, the root of 200, to be equals to, to be equals to the root of 25 times the root of 8. Okay, okay. Having done this, so wherever we see root of two hundred, we are putting root of twenty-five times root of four. Of it. so we can have this to be a to the power of a is equals to two home bracket root of twenty-five times the root of eight or close bracket. So having done this, having done this, I will know the root of twenty-five to be equal to what to be equal to five, right? So we can have this, which implies we are having a to the power of a is equals to 2 to the power of uh, 5 times root of of 8 close the bracket so if we are having this now we are having something like this recall we are having this to be a to the power of a is also equals to uh, 2 to the power of 5 of root of 8 so it still remains it still remains the same it still remains the same so we are not having this uh, recall uh, from our power number from the rules of indices it says if we're having a to the power of mn is also equals to a to the power of m or to the power of n so if we should put this principle here we can have this a to the power of a is equals to uh, 2 to the power of 5 or to the power of root 8 okay root 8 Okay, we are not having this. We are not having this. So, so if we're having this, we're having this. So we can say, and we know, two to the power of five is also equals to thirty-two, right? So we can have this to be a to the power of a is equals to thirty-two. Thirty-two, or to the power of root of eight, or to the power of root of eight. So if we are having this root 32 is also equals to the square root of 32 or to square because this square will cancel the square root right 32 is also equals to root of 32 or square so wherever we see this 32 we are putting square root of this or this so we can say a to the power of a is equals to the root of 32 2 times this root 8 root 8 okay we're not having this we're not having this we're not having this okay since we've done this since we've done this what are we simply going to do note also note note that 2 is also equals to the root of of 4 okay so we can say a to the power of a is equals to the root of 32 a root of 4 times root of of 8 okay we said 2 is also equal to the root of 4 and we are having 8 here so wherever we see 2 we are putting root of 4 times root of 8 now let's come this way let's come this way let's come a little bit this way so having this so we can simply come here 
I'll simply come here and say a a to the power of a is now equals to the root of 32 of root of 4 times root of 8. Recall we said if we are having root of p times root of q is also equals to the whole root of p times q. Okay, so if you apply this principle here, we we'll have this to be a to the power of a is equals to root of 32 or to root of 4 times 8. Now 4 times 8 is going to give us 32. So we're having a to the power of a is equals to open bracket root of 32 close bracket or to the root of 32. So by comparison, by comparison, you can see the base number is equal to the root of 32. A power number is also equal to the root of 32. Therefore, a is equal to root 32. So this is the final answer for it. So if you find this video useful and interesting, uh, please don't forget to click on the subscription button if you have not done that and also hit on the notification button so that you get notified anytime I drop videos on mathematics. And also please also don't forget the, to hit on the top sub button. Bye for now and see you in my subsequent video. God bless you and Jesus loves you. Thank you.